Hey guys, so um, a few of you guys asked for there to be like a dorm tour of the Ferris dorms and I live in a four person suite and pretty much like most of you guys will get a four person suite. There are a few three person suites in Ferris that um, the mentors get some of them but also some freshmen uh, are placed in three person suites but by and large most of you guys will get a four person suite so that's what we have here. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick tour of that and if you have any specific questions I will continue to be in Ferris until the 9th when I will be moving somewhere. Point being, anyway. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going with this. Let's just, I'm just gonna show you guys the, the, the door. So this here is the common area. This is the space that you and your roommates will share and um, it comes with a couch as you can see over there and over in the kitchenette area I've placed the, um, the armchair that's usually uh, in the common room over there just because I'm the only one here and I miss my roommates. Um, so the common area is pretty large, like you have a lot of space and um, if you have any large pieces of furniture that you're interested in bringing, probably they will fit in here if they won't fit anywhere else. Um, but if you guys have any questions about measurements, I can definitely help out with that. The four person rooms have like a huge window in the common area, which is really nice. And one of my favorite parts of Ferris rooms are these absolute units of a windowsill that you can just fit so, so many plants on. <laughs> um, and uh, by the way, pro tip, if you're gonna hang up like, like decorations, um, use command strips, but like not tape, <laughs> but off-brand command strips will rip so easily. So uh, go, for, go for the good stuff. Um, anyway, so here's the kitchenette area. It's also pretty large. If you have like a table or something, that's, where will most likely fit. Um, you've got like counter space and some cabinets that are pretty large, like there's a lot of space in here. Um, just just uh, mugs and things. But you have two drawers uh, that have a lot of space. Each suite comes with a refrigerator, which is very nice. You do have to bring a microwave. Unfortunately, they don't come with a microwave, although there is a microwave downstairs in the lobby. So that's pretty sick. But um, if you're the sort of person who likes to like, make 3 a.m. mac and cheese and doesn't want to go all the way downstairs, make sure uh, you or one of your roommates um, bring a microwave. Um, let's see, let's look at the storage room next. So um, please don't mind the mess because I'm moving out of Ferris, this is so sad. But um, the, the storage room has quite a lot of space but it has no shelving. So if you like want to store a lot of food or just general items in here, bring Shelving, it'll come in handy. I brought this, and as you can see, she's she's struggling a little, struggling a little bit. Um, so yeah, bring bring good shelving. Uh, you'll thank yourself. Okay. Oh, wonder what that was. <clears throat> it's fine. Um, so okay, so some people had questions about like the bathroom area, so I just wanted to give you guys an idea of that. Hello, hi, how are you doing? Um, okay, so the way that bathrooms in the four person rooms are split up is that you have, um, please don't mind my dirty dishes. Anyway, you have like the toilet in one room, the shower in another, and then like the sinks and mirrors in a separate area. So um, that means you can multitask, it's great, it's fun, it's fresh, but these are the only two sinks you have in your suite. So you will have to do your dishes uh, in the bathroom sink. As far as the bathroom goes, it doesn't have any shelves like the storage room, so definitely bring some sort of shelving that you can just like set, like a little stool or something, or just like um, something you can hang on the wall. There is a little bit of like storage space in the actual shower, but it makes a big difference to have something that you can have outside the shower and therefore keep dry. Um, also, bring a bath mat, it's cool and great. The showers in Ferris actually come with a shower curtain, which was not something that I knew when I moved in. So we ended up, <laughs> my suite ended up with like nine, not nine, like maybe five shower curtains. It was, it was a lot. We had, we had a lot. Um, but point being, they come with them. So if, if you don't want to have to get one, you don't have to, but if you want a cute one, go for it. Um, okay. So there is a lot of storage space under the sinks for sure. So if you have like some sort of cart or something you crawl under there, there is a lot of storage space to take advantage of there. Don't forget a trash can. Very useful. Um, yeah, that's that's all the comments I had. Uh, unplug things before you use the sink. It's safety, safety, 
be safe. Um, you also have some shelves here. Very handy, very good. They move up and down, so like if you have a particularly tall thing that you're trying to fit in here, um, you can adjust them definitely to accommodate for that. And they're also, like these are very deep. Like that's my whole arm, okay? Um, so you, you've got a lot of space to work with there. Um, so yes, there you go. Um, but let's look at one of the long rooms. I have a square room. So the way the four person rooms are arranged is, hmm, where's the light switch? I always forget where the light switch is. Um, the, the way the four person rooms are arranged is that you have, um, f the rooms are not, well, lettered A, B, C, and D. So B and C are both, um, B and C are both square rooms, and A and D are long rooms like this. So the long rooms are a little bit, they're, they're cool, but they're a little weird. So you've got a lot of space. You've got sort of a square looking area. And then you've got an appendage, if that makes sense, where you've got your window in the corner and this diagonal wall. A lot of people really like the long rooms because just the design, like it can be really cozy with you have your study corner, your bed, everything. Um, oh. Let me back up, let me back up. The storage, um, the wardrobe, very nice, very funky, very fresh. So I sent a picture of the wardrobe previously in the group chat, but I just wanted to give you guys an idea of how much space is really in here. You have two of these huge drawers and I can climb my whole self out. Gosh, yeah, okay. So some people had some questions about the, um, sort of furniture that's going on with these. So each room in Ferris comes with a desk, which is that thing, and then a nightstand, which is that thing, but they are exactly the same height and shape. So you, what I did, um, please do not mind the mess, um, was just push them together and make a super long desk. But not everyone does that, and that's totally valid. Um, the dresser comes with, both of them have this piece that slides out. Um, to give you some more surface area. And the dresser comes with this huge drawer uh, that you can work with. And you also have some space under here. Uh, this is MJ's room and it looks like she put her shelf down on the bottom, but you can also lift that back up and have two shelves going on there. Similar thing with the desk, you have a piece that slides out up here um, to give you some more surface area, some more space to work. You also have a shelf in the back uh, just for extra storage. And each of the rooms have a window of about this size. Um, with a similarly wide windowsill, so nice plants and stuff. Um, the, the blinds are great, but if you're the sort of person who like needs your room to be totally dark to sleep, I highly recommend curtains. I didn't bring any because I'm not that sort of person, but you know, brick curtains, they're nice. Uh, um, so that is one of the long rooms. And I'm going to clean up my room before I show that to you guys because um, we're not about that life. So I will be right back. Okay, my room is freshly clean. So let me show you what the square rooms, which is going to be B and C, C is over there, look like. Oh, by the way, I didn't talk about that. This, okay, you've got, the rooms are numbered. If this, this is like intro door, that's where the hallway is. You've got A, B, C and D, that's how the rooms are arranged, just so you guys know. Anyway, <laughs> freshly clean square room. So, as you can see, it's like much, it's, it's, it's a very different shape than the long rooms. And um, my, not all square rooms have this, but my room had like this sort of odd protrusion here and also a diagonal wall here. So you might have to work with like some unusual wall shapes, but it gives you lots of surface area to hang up posters. Um, like I said, each of the rooms have these lovely, nice windows with huge window sills. And um, like I mentioned earlier, I pushed my two desks together uh, to make a super desk. We've got um, Lysol to fight off Miss Rona. We've got day old Hawaiian punch because we live bougie here in Ferris. Um, and we've got a lovely letter from Mentor Ashley. Love her. Shout out to Mentor Ashley. We stand. We've got a deceased thyme plant. Um, yeah, I, I promise I'm a good plant mom. She just, it was it was just her time. It's fine. Um, by the way, bike racks. We've got lots of them at Ferris. Just wanted to put that out there. Ooh, do you guys know about the hammock farm? Oh my god. Okay. The 
the hyper is right across the street from Ferris, and um, at the hyper you can rent uh, hammocks or like check out hammocks, like you sort of like you do books at a library, and um, that like little area over there with the posts is where you can hang them up and take a nice little nap in a hammock that you have checked out from the hyper center. It's very cool and fun, and you pay for that as part of your tuition, so it doesn't cost you anything after you already get here. Another thing to mention, uh, we got swings. It's cool and it's great and they're great and uh, I love them so much. Lots of happy memories of those swings. By the way, that's New Hall. Just so, just so you actually, UCA tour. Ah, ha, ha. Um, that's New Hall and that is, oh, which one is that? Give me a second. Hughes. That's Hughes. I know how things work. Then you've got um, Mashburn over there, that's the education building, so shout out to the education majors, you don't have to walk far at all. And then that's the other wing of Ferris, I've got a window that faces the courtyard. Um, so I get to watch people do like just crazy things all of the time. One time I was like studying and some people were like blowing bubbles outside the window, so there was just like streams of bubbles floating by, it was great, it was fun. Um, so that should be pretty much it. If you guys have any specific questions, like I mentioned before, let me know. I can do measurements for you. I can get you pictures. I can answer things. I will be here until the night to take measurements. Or, you know, after that I continu can continue to answer questions, but it I just won't be able to like measure things or take pictures. Um, that's pretty much it. I love you guys so much, so much. And I hope that you're all doing so well and having a lovely summer. And um, I can't wait to see you. Goodbye.